Hi guys, what's up? It's Axe, and we are back with another episode of Forza Horizons. Uh, and we're going to go off to an event. I think this is a Class C event that uh, should be interesting. I think it's for classic cars. I didn't really ever look at it too much. A circuit race, so it should be interesting. Um, let's hope we can have some good, fun, clean racing. Whoa, we're jumping everywhere. I got that blue blue watch. No, it's not there, is it? No. Where I'm, I'm like stopping like where are we going where are we going still 1.3 miles it? yeah Alex still 1.3 miles whoa uh, whoa no 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 how on how did we not the Maserati must be absolutely you know getting a bit scared that this old Corrado might be rolling into him <laughs> I'd be scared too if I'm totally honest if I see a, if I saw a Corrado coming at me that's rolling and all broken up, and I'm holding a Maserati. And yeah, I'd be scared for sure. Cool. I don't know if that's his name, his nickname, but yeah, pretty cool. Drift, drift, drift. How on earth did we do that? All right. Uh, pre-1980 cars. Do we have any? No. It's good that we didn't sell that car then. <laughs> I was looking at it, it's like, it's, yeah, I can get quite a bit of money off this car, but luckily I didn't sell it because it's now going to come in use, which is good. Loading menus never interesting, but that's the way it always shows difficulty. Do you want to turn up difficulty and, you know, get B in every single race? Old Spice US Muscle Mash. I've been watching quite a lot of interesting classic cars at Brands Hatch. Really, you know, really happy that I got a season ticket for Brands Hatch for Christmas last year. It does mean I can go and see a lot of really good events at Brands Hatch. And obviously, it's a lot cheaper doing it that way around. And it's not just for Brands Hatch either, you can use it at Alton Park. Uh, and all of the other MSV tracks, which is good, but unfortunately I don't really live anywhere near them, so it's a bit of a challenge to get to those. Mustang, keep on sliding. A bit slow in a straight line, I'm not going to lie. I found that I think in a couple of races before. What's this that Howard's driving? Is that a Buick? Mm, I'm not too sure. You can leave a comment if you know what car that is, but I do remember it from somewhere. Oops, sorry. Actually, no, I shouldn't say sorry because, you know, he always crashes into me and says um, I suck. We're getting to the front, actually, a bit here. Okada. One lap to go. Can we go for the win? I don't know. Howard's going for the move. Oh, our car has just run completely wide there. There's a gap on the inside. I took second. Of, is that the Pontiac Firebird? Oh, he's, he's braked. I'm using them barriers just for, you know, this contact. A bit of a British touring car style contact, just running into each other with a corner or two to go, like Andrew Jordan and Jason Plato at Brands Hatch this year. But there we are, across the line, grabbing the win. Not too bad. <laughs> Hopefully I can win some more, that is the plan. 470, so that's about 5 or 6 more events I'd say. That's if I win them. The music in this is really good. This game, it's really good music. I think I said that in the last episode. Oh no. I 
think we'll go for that one. Buy treasure map. So uh, we'll go to this event and see how we can do. 9.5 miles though, so that's going to be quite boring. But um, yeah, um, I suppose I'll use this long journey maybe to... Someone's saying something. Is that kind of radio or water? I don't know. Um, but yeah, I, I haven't really been seeing many racing games being announced for this year. It's a bit weird. I, there's normally lots of games that people are out there, you know, producing. But this year there hasn't been a big amount. Oh, Mr. Mr. Turning. There hasn't been a huge amount of people sort of making games. And, uh, you know, I've got a couple of games here that I could do Let's Plays of that are older. But I'm certainly uh, interested to see uh, some games coming out soon. If you know any new developers are coming about with the new gen consoles, whoops, sorry. But maybe games like Project Cars, R Factor, they don't really have a sort of story mode like a lot of Xbox games do. A lot of driving in this video. I, I, we might not even get there in time. It's a bit. A bit annoying. We might uh, have to do the race for this in the next episode, so a bit annoying. But if this drive is long, that's what's going to have to happen. Sometimes it's just nice to listen to the music, especially when you're blasting through a town at 140 miles an hour. Uh, risky, 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 risky. No, 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 that didn't go well. How we got it back onto the road, I don't know. Actually, we should get there. Was that a McLaren? I think it was. Ugh, speed track. Personal best was a lot better through there. Is that the balloon challenge? I think one of the first things I think I did on this game. I must have driven this before. Because the, the grey dots, I think, are the barriers. Must have. Another another racer up here. Looks like I'm chasing down. He's probably in a lot faster car than me, and he's not going too fast. Jensen. Ah. Yeah, this is going to be, uh, sadly, the next episode will be when the race is at. This pink slip challenge. So, uh, if you want to tune out now, that's awesome. That's fine. I, I, do, I do know that a lot of people probably will tune out at this point, just because I sort of had to announce that but yeah looking forward to the race though but I might just talk about some racing games I mean over here I've got shift 2 I don't know whether that's really got a very good career mode sort of story mode whatever uh, I've got Forza 4 I probably won't do that uh, <laughs> I really don't want to be doing a for another Forza game I know these games are ultra long so Radio announcer, <laughs> it's quite funny. So this Barnett person, has he got a Lamborghini Diablo? It's really nice just driving. I know it's like, yeah, it's a bit boring, but yeah, if you do have any games you'd like me to let's play, let me know. It doesn't need to be a new game. 
if anything it's probably easier to have an old game but I don't want to be doing something that somebody's played a million times before uh, obviously this and Dirt 3 have been played a bunch NASCAR 2011 actually hasn't if you type in NASCAR 2011 walkthrough mine's the pretty much the only one there uh, Toka 3 not many people do that so that's it you know I'm trying to mix it up with games that a lot of people have done and whatever but to be honest the, the, the games everyone's played they're normally quite long I'm gonna find that with this game I'm sure nearly there one mile to go it's been an extremely long journey Hundred and fifty fifth in the world. Popular popularity Ugh, can't get my pronunciations. Ooh, whoops. Yay, more upgrades. Nearly there. There it is on the mini map. But um yeah, so I'm gonna say I'll see you in the next episode guys. We'll do this race in the next episode. So yeah. Have a wonderful day. It's been Alex, I'm out of here. Goodbye.